everyone let us discuss this concept series okay so we are familiar with the sequence of real numbers so when we take sum of all terms of sequence we get a series getting so let us see one example uh consider a sequence let me consider a sequence consider a sequence xn okay so then corresponding series corresponding series is summation xn okay summation xn and running from 1 to infinity so you know that in a sequence we have infinite terms so if you add all these terms we get a series that means if you expand this summation we will have like this x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus and so on xn plus and so on so we call it as a series so let us take one particular example for example consider a sequence consider a sequence 1 by n then series will be see corresponding series will be summation 1 by n and running from 1 to infinity so we are familiar with the sequence 1 by n which terms are 1 1 by 2 1 by 3 1 by 4 and so on so if we add all these terms we will get a series that means summation 1 by n will be 1 plus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 4 plus and so on 1 by n and so on so we call it as a series so it's very simple concept if you are already familiar with the terms sequence okay we simply we take sum of all terms of a sequence and we get a series so the next concept is sequence of partial sum it plays a very significant role in this topic series so let us discuss sequence of partial sum okay make a screenshot of it first then we will go further so consider a series summation n okay we are going to discuss sequence of partial sum concept okay so when we have series summation a n let sn i am considering sn be a sequence of partial sum of series summation n okay n running from 1 to infinity i am calling it as sn which is a sequence of partial sum of series n summation n so then s1 will be a1 getting s2 will be a1 plus a2 will you tell me what will be s3 it is a1 plus a2 plus a3 that means s3 will be some uh, sum of first three terms s4 will be sum of first four terms getting a3 plus a4 and so on so in general we can write sn is equal to sum of first n terms so that means we will have like this and so on so that means for each series we have a sequence of partial sum and we define in this way getting let us discuss one example okay so i am considering a sequence consider a series i will consider consider a series summation n running from 1 to infinity n square okay i am calling sn be a sequence of partial sum of this series let sn be a sequence of partial sum okay i'm considering sn be a sequence of partial sum of that series summation n square then therefore s1 s1 will be that means only first term which is one square getting next s2 so sum of first two terms so if i put n is equal to one one square if i put n is equal to two two square s3 sum of first three terms one square plus two square plus three square and so on and obviously sn will be one square plus two square for plus and so on n square and so on so that means for each series we have sequence of partial sum okay so make a screenshot of it after that we will stop thank you bye bye